Okay, boys and girls. Uh, Senator Clark in Kentucky has proposed a medical marijuana bill. And I'm going to be pulling this up so I could post the uh, website where I found where he is go he proposed this bill. So I'm going to put this in the description of my video, but first I'm going to talk to you about the legalization of marijuana and what it would do to help the government in its own system and own way. 85% of U.S. citizens has smoked or is still smoking marijuana. And I say marijuana because pot, weed, and everything else, people look at that as a drug. And the thing is, is, people's far off from what a drug honestly is. A drug is a chemically altered thing. It is man-made. Marijuana is not man-made. Weed, marijuana, ganja. You get where I'm going with this. It is not man-made. It is an herb. It is grown in the ground. THC is automatically in your body and this is for all you politicians out there who think that weed is a uh, bad weed is drug it le it's a gateway drug wrong there is no such thing as a gateway drug if you're gonna do this and you decide to do something else that's you on your own ability just because you smoke pot doesn't mean you're gonna go out and snort a pill or just because you smoke pot doesn't mean you're gonna fucking do crank I've been a pothead all my life, and you know I have done other things, but I don't like them. I would rather smoke pot, be happy, play my games, make my videos, and prove to everybody that marijuana is not a gateway drug because it's not. People choose to do other drugs. If marijuana was a gateway drug, then everybody who smoked weed would be on it but wrong it is not a gateway drug and this is for all you politicians out there marijuana would help the economy so much with all the americans that would that go out and buy pot off of drug dealers every fucking day all that money could be taxed and legalized and taxed to you you would get the revenue off this because if you was to put this in stores to where every American could have the choice of walking in and getting it, just like cigarettes, tobacco, and everything else. If we got ID'd for marijuana in a store to walk in and buy it, just like we did with cigarettes and beer and shit that harms you, there are more recorded deaths off of peanuts than pot. That's right, y'all. Pot is safer than peanuts. 435,000 U.S. citizens die every year from smoking cigarettes. And I'm a smoker. I smoke cigarettes. Don't get me wrong. I like cigarettes. But 435,000 Americans die every year from cigarette smoke and cigarette inhalation. And that's not just cancer. I ain't talking about cancer. I'm talking about people who fall asleep with cigarettes in their hands. Because tobacco does not go out. Marijuana does. After you lay... I can lay a fucking joint on my leg and that motherfucker will go out. Because it gets sticky. Because of the resin. What does pot do for, uh, what does pot do for you? Let's take a look. It calms anxiety. It calms your nerves. If you don't eat, it will make you eat. If you eat a lot, it will keep you from eating. I mean, it's just there's so many good things about marijuana. THC is automatically in your body. There's already endorphins in your body for THC. When you smoke weed, it releases that THC endorphin in your brain. Like I said, pot is not a gateway drug. But Senator Clark, and I'm still looking for this, Senator Clark proposed a legalization of marijuana in Kentucky. Now I'm set up for a doctor just as soon as it comes here because I do have problems. But I do not complain about them all the time. 
I am set up for a doctor just as soon as it legalizes in the state of Kentucky that I will be able to walk into a dispensary and get it. But the way I see it, if, if the dispensaries don't want me to have it, I'll just get it off of a dealer, like usual. But, hold on a second, let me type this in so I can get this pulled up and I will read the article off of it. Motherfuck. <clears throat> and this is on MSNBC. Alright. What the fuck, you piece of shit? God damn it. Back to the news, you prick. I don't care about you pop up, you motherfucker. Anyhow, a Louisville lawmaker was the one that put this long shot of legalization Thursday. I think it was either last Thursday or Thursday before that. Legalization of marijuana for medical purposes in Kentucky. Uh, Senator Clark actually wanted this to be legalized because he's seen revenue, he's seen dollar signs. He's seen how bad he's seen how good it helped people in California and all these other states. It does help people. Cancer patients are less are in less pain because of marijuana. Not only that, marijuana heals cancer. And this is my point of view on it. I've done the math if let's just say that my eighty five percent of American thing and they still smoke it. All right, eighty-five percent of Americans—that's what uh, three, four million people, or something like that. I can't remember how many's in the U.S. It's like three hundred million, something. Uh, anyhow, but say two hundred million Americans smoke pot, and it's legalized all across the U.S. I mean, in stores and all. You can walk in, be 18 years old, hold an ID out, and buy it. Do you realize how much revenue it would pull for the state if they would tax it? And how much money our country would pull in if we could actually sell this to Amsterdam? Because Amsterdam does the same thing we're doing now, except they sell theirs to anybody. Amsterdam and Jamaica have really good economy due to marijuana. Everybody says marijuana makes you lazy. No. If you would open up marijuana, marijuana can grow all across the U.S. All fucking across it. Greenhouse and all. If you would open up the borders and just let marijuana in and out of this country as a legal trade, not only would you be making money off of other countries, but you would be making money in your own country. Say 200 million Americans smoke pot by next year. We would bring in an $80 billion revenue just from fucking taxes. Not everybody smokes cigarettes, but more Americans smoke pot than cigarettes. More people would rather smoke a joint than to smoke a cigarette. Why? Because it does nothing to your lungs. Because it does not hurt your body. Because it is legal. Because it is soon to be a legal herb. Because it is an herb. Because it is grown from the ground. Pot is better for you than anything because it is an herb but eighty billion dollar revenue just in your country alone now imagine if it was a trade across seas imagine if you could sell from this country to Amsterdam and Amsterdam could sell theirs from their country to here and all these other countries that have marijuana will be able to sell to the U.S. and Amsterdam because we would open up our borders for this trade. Everybody would have money. Everybody could grow this plant, this money maker. We could open up farms for it. Thousands and thousands of acres of just straight marijuana. And it would be a completely ecological thing. It would be a blast from the past. 
in the 70s, we had to where you could walk down the road and smoke a joint, and the cops would take you home. Now you go to jail for five to ten years. That's bullshit. DUIs get less than marijuana charges. Rapists get less than marijuana charges. Pedophiles get less than marijuana charges. And you wonder why us potheads get so fucking angry because we go to jail for wanting to smoke a joint because we're in a, we have our own culture. We are in a melting pot. Allow us to have our culture, you pieces of shit. Obama and the rest of the government need to be taken off the face of this map and redone. We need to reform our government organization. We need to bring in these melting pots and all these other cultures. We need to allow the culturalization of marijuana. We need to have marijuana in our culture because it is a great thing. It's a good herb. It is very, very good herb. It heals it. It does so many things for the human body, and it's better than any type of drug that you can bring out. Pills harms the liver. Marijuana does nothing. Marijuana doesn't even hurt your brain. If you want me to be honest about it, it actually makes you concentrate a little bit more. It makes you want to, makes you interested in things. Hell, a fly is interesting. But if you was to open up the borders and allow this. Allow this to be sold across seas. You would be bringing in more revenue than you thought of. Because everybody, all these countries have pot. One way or another. Mexico has a shit ton of it. Amsterdam has a lot. Jamaica, a lot. What we need to do is open up the country. Open up the borders for marijuana. Exportation. Importation. And sell and bring in. Bring back the economy. Pay off our debts to these other countries so we can have made in USA again. Not made in fucking China. That's all I'm saying. Alright, peace y'all. Stay high. This video is a little bit long, but I don't really care. Rate, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you think. Peace.